ado, let me invite our very first writer for this evening, and he is Cyril Wong, up on stage. So, uh, let me just give a short introduction of Cyril Wong. Cyril is the author of 11 publications, and his poems have appeared in international journals such as Atlanta Review, The Courtland Review, and Poetry International, among others. Yeah, so it's your own piece. Hello. Uh, okay. I'm actually the, the last person anyone should ask about, you know, tips on writing, because, you know, I always believe that uh, if you have something to say or something to express, you just do it regardless of the consequences. And I love consequences. Uh, so I will just share a poem, which I think kind of like perhaps sums up some of my beliefs, I guess. So this one is by one of my favorite poets called Charles uh, Bukowski. And this is called, So You Want to Be a Writer. So I guess, I hope this is a suitable introduction to all the tips that you hear later on, yeah? So you want to be a writer. If it doesn't come bursting out of you in spite of everything, don't do it. Unless it comes unasked out of your heart, your mind, your mouth and your gut, don't do it. If you have to sit for hours staring at your computer screen or hunch over your keyboard, searching for words, don't do it. If you're doing it for money or fame, don't do it. If you're doing it because you want women or men in your bed, don't do it. If you have to sit there and rewrite it again and again, don't do it. If it's hard work just thinking about doing it, don't do it. If you're trying to write like somebody else, forget about it. If you have to wait for it to roar out of you, then wait patiently. If it never does roar out of you, do something else. If you first have to read it to your wife or your girlfriend or your boyfriend or your parents or to anybody at all, you're not ready. Don't be like so many writers. Don't be like so many thousands of fucking people who call themselves writers. Don't be dull and boring and pretentious. Don't be consumed with self-love. The libraries of the world have yawned themselves to sleep over your kind. Don't add to that. Don't do it. Unless it comes out of your soul like a rocket. Unless being still would drive you to madness or suicide or murder, don't do it. Unless the sun inside you is burning your gut, don't do it. When it's truly time and if you have been chosen, it will do it by itself and it will keep on doing it until you die or it dies in you. There is no other way and there never was. Thank you. <laughs> 